Turning now to national news, President Trump saying enough is enough and his administration will fight subpoenas from Congress. The political standoff comes as House Democrats call for further investigation in the wake of the Mueller probe. Fox News correspondent Lauren Blanchard in Washington with the latest. The Mueller investigation may be over, but congressional Democrats still have more questions. The president is brushing off those subpoenas, calling them ridiculous. I say it's enough. President Trump planning to say no to any more White House staff testifying to Congress, saying Democrats are investigating his administration and issuing subpoenas for political reasons. The Democrats are trying to win 2020. The president's remarks coming nearly a week after the release of the special counsel's redacted report. He says the Mueller investigation was sufficient and is dismissing lawmakers' requests to review his financial records. Mueller, I assume, for $35 million checked my taxes checked my financials, which are great, by the way. This has Speaker Nancy Pelosi pushing back on the idea of impeachment proceedings in the House, saying Thank Democrats can hold the president accountable through aggressive investigations. We now see the administration engaged in stonewalling of the facts coming to the American people. On Twitter, the president saying, if the partisan Dems ever tried to impeach, I would first head to the U.S. Supreme Court. Not only are there no high crimes and misdemeanors, there are no crimes by me at all. You need to have an overwhelming bipartisan consensus to remove a president from office. And I think that's what the Democrats are wrestling with now. Even though Robert Mueller said in his report that Congress has the authority to conduct additional probes, this power struggle between the president and House Democrats will likely be decided in the courts. In Washington, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.